Hi, in this lecture, we will go over the downloadable files for the course. You can download the files via a link that will be available in the resource files for this lecture. Starting from the very top, right here, you will have some access to audio files that will bring our game to life. Listed here, we have some background music, a click sound for when a player taps a button, an enemy hit sound, a game over sound, a player hit sound, and a throw sound for when the ninja throws the ninja stars. In a later video, you will learn more about where to find free sounds for your game. Next, we have build.settings and config.lua. These files essentially set up the app and specify things like screen size, what screen orientations are supported, in this case, it's just portrait mode, and more. We'll be discussing these files in more detail. We also have another folder for images. Inside the images folder, you'll have everything you need to display, pirates, ninjas, and more. After that, you'll see load save.lua, which will allow us to save player information, such as what rank their upgrades are and how much money they have earned. This file comes from Rob Miracle, and if you would like to see the original file, take a look at the description for this lecture for a link to the file in GitHub. You'll also have the Made in China font, which is a free font from defont.com and is available for commercial purposes. Finally, you'll have a shell from main.lua. Main.lua is the starting point of every Corona SDK built app, and we will discuss this file in more detail. All of the assets here are available for commercial purposes. For example, the graphics were either created by me or commissioned by me for this course. But some of the sound files require that you give credit to the author. For these credits, please refer to the description. In the next lecture, you'll receive a quick refresher on Lua. If you already know Lua, feel free to skip to the next lecture after that.